I must confess that I did uh, let my uh, blue microfiber cloth make contact with a hot header pipe here. And uh, this is the result. So I got to get this off. And uh, I was talking to my uh, mechanic about this and he recommended uh, easy off oven cleaner and uh, some uh, a very very fine steel wool so I'm going to give it a shot this is what the pipe looks like now and uh, I'm going to take the bike out for a little ride warm it up because the uh, pipe uh, should be warm when you uh, put the easy off oven cleaner on it and when I get back I'll show you the two products and uh, we'll take this off and see how it works. Okay, so going for a little ride and uh, be back with you shortly. Okay guys, so this is the worst part that I was really showing you before. Let's see what kind of a difference we can make on this. Once again, a little more on the steel wool and some on the pipe. Not hoping to get the original bluing out, of course. And let's see what happens. Okay, it is taking it off. Looks like we'll need a little bit of elbow grease to get it off, but it is coming off. See that? Okay, let me get the whole pipe cleaned up and I'll show you the finished product. Okay, well, as you can see, there's still some left on there, but a lot of it has come off. And uh, I suspect that the rest of it will come off if I uh, fire the bike back up again and bring the, the pipe back up to temperature. I think the key on this is to apply the Easy Off oven cleaner when the pipe is quite hot so that it sizzles. And that sizzling action is what removes the uh, crust. So that's what I'm going to do. So this is the finished product. <clears throat> I think it came out pretty good. Um, I've got to tell you, I'm pretty satisfied with it. I, never, I didn't expect to get the, the bluing out up in here. That was there before, and that, that's not coming out at this stage. But anyhow, a um, little bit of a cautionary tale on this, guys. Make sure you don't burn yourself when you do this. Uh, I highly suggest gloves. You use some gloves. And uh, make sure that you don't burn your hands when you're doing this. That header pipe is extremely hot, and the steel wool does heat up. So uh, I anticipated that would happen, so I did not burn myself, but I could well imagine that uh, you could end up burning yourself on this if you don't wear some gloves or protect your hands. But anyway, this works. This will work for, for most things. This was a microfiber cloth in my case, but, you know, it'll work for uh, rubber and uh, boot heels, you know, scuff marks and really anything uh, that you need to get off your header pipe and the beauty of it is is you don't scratch the chrome <laughs> 